what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back it's your boy terry by reacts man we are back in the house once again for some more jojo's bizarre adventures stardust crusaders um this has been a ride so far this has been a ride so far so i'm not gonna bore you guys with a with a with a with a long opening i just want to keep reminding you guys that if you want to you can support the channel by joining the membership and of course subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed yet subscribe to the channel we do have early access to shows that are available for early access right now it's going to be two animes and one tv show which is dark um and the animes are monster and slam dunk okay so i'm planning to add another anime to um to early access um or rather not i'll probably just put it out on the channel um i don't know yet but we'll we'll see how things go when it comes on to that anime because i'm kind of waiting on the season for this anime to finish so that i can dive into it fully um because it is currently going on right now it's the anime that i want to do as a modern anime to just Get it out of the way there's a bunch of anime that's only like 12 13 episodes that i want to just knock out on the channel boom 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 before season two of these animes drop so i'm looking forward to doing that but in any case i appreciate you guys thank you guys for tuning in as always let's go watch these episodes and i will see you guys for the review All right, so that was episode seven and eight. <laughs> this show, uh, it, it's, it amazes me. It amazes me. And, I, and I'm not gonna stop saying that because it is. It, it is, it amazes me. You know what I'm saying? And it's not only the length that they go. You know what I'm saying? It's not only the length that they go to portray certain things. But it's also in the, the, the subtleness of the stuff that they do to, you know, if you want to talk about a technical level of anime that just has all of these tropes of anime also, and just kind of emulates everything you want to see in an, in an anime in one. You get what I'm saying? As I said, the story is not anything too, you know what I'm saying, deep. You know what I mean? It's not anything deep. It's just more lore based more than anything else. And when I say lore based, I mean they draw from a lot of real life stuff. You get what I'm saying? They draw from a lot of real life stuff. And they also like you're like, what are they going to do next? You get what I'm saying? It's more of like it more of in that lane more than anything else. Um, So is Kak is his name? Kakyojin? Oh, oh, I hope I'm saying that right. Kakyojin. Um, is he really a spy? Is he a spy? You know what I'm saying? I wonder if Dio has some sort of like, like has somebody for him or something like that, because it doesn't make sense. Cause I thought that after they removed that parasite thing, they're free to do whatever they want, but maybe that was the plan, but he was the first one that they took it out of. So how was that the plan? Why, why isn't that the plan? with um i can't remember his name per 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 off <laughs> per 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 did i just say per off that's what i just said right per off are you serious did i just say per off so you have kaki kaki kakyojin right kakyojin um right i'm trying to remember the name guys just give me a little bit of time kakyojin and the french guy man i can't remember his name they said it so much during that during episode eight too all right so i'm trying to find it here i'm not gonna cut it out man you know you know so they um yeah paul Nareff. so paul Nareff was the second one they took the thing out of right and because he was being controlled too they saved him and he was okay but is he really is kakujin really a spy among them i don't 
I don't think so. I'm still gonna be hopeful because I like him as a character. I really do like him, even though his stand is kind of kind of weak, weak sauce. You know what I'm saying? I don't really mess with his stand too tough. I think he got the weakest stand out of all of them. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, and maybe that's the reason why he has to be the way he is, or maybe that's the reason why he has to be a spy, because he knows his stand is not the greatest. You know what I'm saying? Um so yeah man when it comes on to um this anime and where it's going like dio you know throwing it out here i think the only reason why dio has a stand is because he has jonathan's body you know what i'm saying um and we've yet to see what his stand can do you know what i'm saying so he's always gonna know where all the joe stars are at because he's connected to that body right um so the Joe Star, um, I think the most intriguing thing, if you want to go like, um, as I said, it's very lore based. So it's like, I think the most intriguing thing about this entire series so far is the fact is the Joe Star, um, the Joe Star bloodline. The Joe Star bloodline is a very special bloodline, apparently. I mean, the story is about them. You get what I'm saying? So, so, um. The, the bloodline gets stronger. I mean, in the bloodline gets stronger as it goes along, as the years passes, grandson to grandson to grandson to grandson, whatever. The bloodline gets stronger as it goes as it goes along. And it seems to be that. It seems like anybody can manifest stands also. So it's like, but I think Joe Star bloodline may have some of the best or the strongest stands there is dio is connected to the joe star bloodline he was adopted into it but he's not really blood blood you know what i'm saying but now he's actually has the body of a joe star so we're gonna see how that plays out um soul sacrifice very intriguing stand i enjoyed that i enjoyed um per enough <laughs> i just i just completely butchered that name paul naref <laughs> paul naref paul naref paul naref paul naref hopefully i can remember that paul naref um between paul naref and soul sacrifice it was a pretty intriguing fight i liked it um and as i said before like i think we are getting a lot more fights now than we usually get in JoJo. I think the last one where, where you know, it was Joseph versus um, the three whatever dudes, vampires that live forever. I think, um, I think those were very intriguing fights. Don't get me wrong. Um, so throughout that throughout that season, you know, everything played out well. It was well done. But I think I like these five more. I don't know if it, I don't know if it's because it's there's a lot of strategy behind it. Even though they explain everything about their powers before, you know what I'm saying before they actually do anything. So, <laughs> you know, but that's to come. That's to understand about about this show. It's what it is. You know what I mean? So you can't blame him for that. But in any case, I loved it. I love the fights so far. They're short and sweet. They're not. You know what I'm saying? They're not like overdone. You know what I'm saying? The one with the um it seems like animals can be can have stands too. So that's pretty um that's that that's pretty cool. Um I st still don't know what part this this little girl is going to play in the show. Um I we don't even know if it's a little girl or a lady. I didn't um, I was looking at the fact that I was, and I was like, this kind of weird that they showed, um, her butt and she's a little girl. You know what I'm saying? Like you don't usually see that in anime. You'll see young girls, but you won't see them. Like, um, I don't know what to say. Like, this is not like, it's not a, it, what they call it? Etchy? I think it's, I don't think it's not that type of anime. It's not like borderline hentai stuff. So it's like. I just I didn't understand why they did that on the ship. I didn't talk about it because it was it was just kind of weird. But we're doing the review now, so I can talk about it. Um, I was gonna pause and talk about it, but I was like, nah, let it roll. I'll talk about it in the review. 
um i don't know how old this girl is i don't know how old she is because usually in anime you don't see in an anime like this you don't expect especially i'm pretty sure this is a shonen anime i'm pretty sure it's a shonen anime so it you don't usually see that you'll see you know what i'm saying um they might have a depiction of it but not beer ass naked you know what i'm saying like don't get me wrong we've seen nudity in we've seen nudity in jojo's before that is not new it's just her age is what i'm looking at to be like they shouldn't pr they probably shouldn't have done that i don't know how old she is i don't know if she's under 12 i don't know if she's teenager could be a teenager she's pretty short so it's, it's really hard to tell if it's an actual teenager um um listen i'm not i'm not offended by the fact that they did that i'm not one of those per people who, who i'm not offended by it i'm just looking at it and be like you know what i'm saying there's a possibility that kids might be watching the show so you got to think about that too you get what i'm saying so you don't want to you don't want to put that out there to be you know what i'm saying they they didn't have to is what i'm trying to say it, it wasn't necessary for them to do it you get what i'm saying but i don't have an issue with it per se i'm just pointing that out you know what i'm saying i'm just pointing it out to say it might have been something they didn't have to do you get what i'm saying so um because i was i was a little bit i was a little bit pulled back by it you know what i'm saying um you know i was you know what i'm saying i was watching and i was a little bit pulled back by it and i was going to pause you know <laughs> I was going to pause because I was like, why are they showing this little girl? I don't want to see little girls but on my on my show, man. I don't want to see that. You know what I'm saying? But it is it, it is what it is, you know. Um it took place, whatever. We move on. Anyways. So so yeah, man, I'm looking forward to seeing more of JoJo's. Of course, I got two more episodes to to, to do today. I'm gonna be doing that right after this. So if you see me in the same shirt tomorrow it is what it is <laughs> anyways i'll catch you guys later and I, I i'll see you guys um for episodes 9 and 10 tomorrow okay so i appreciate y'all leave a like on the video leave a comment tell me what you think of that of that the fact that they did that um I, as i said it's not a big deal but i just want to hear what you what are you guys thoughts on them doing that because i don't as i said i don't know how old she is in the show um and i'm not going to go check because i don't want to be spoiled about anything so let me know okay because i know you guys know how old she was how old they were trying to depict her in the show so thank you guys so much i appreciate y'all there bite out peace